Now Foley police investigating two related crimes from early this morning. Yeah, first they say somebody stole a pickup right off a dealer's lot, then drove it to a credit union downtown before trying to break into the ATM. And that pickup was left at the scene, but as our house sheriff found out, police don't have anyone in connection to this case or describe any witnesses. Our house sheriff now reporting more. Crime scene tape blocked off the drive through lanes and ATM at the Alabama Credit Union on Laurel Avenue all day. Police are trying to find out who's responsible for damage and the attempted theft of the ATM machine there. A customer noticed the damage around 7 this morning and called police. When we arrived, uh, we did notice some damage to the ATM machine and we also noticed an abandoned white pickup truck that was left at the scene. That truck was a recent trade-in at Coastal Auto on Highway 59. The owner didn't want to go on camera, but did say the truck must have been stolen sometime overnight. They told me whoever stole it apparently used a screwdriver or similar instrument to crank the truck, damaging the ignition. Right now, investigators have little to go on. At this time, we're still attempting to uh, investigate the crime and obtain surveillance video from uh, business. We're still actively uh, seeking any witnesses who may have seen the crime. Investigators say the theft of the pickup is a felony, and depending on what the investigation into the attempted theft of the ATM machine reveals, it could be as well. We're trying to determine if anything, if anything was actually taken from the ATM machine. We know there was damage, but we cannot, it, we know it was at least an attempted theft, but we don't have enough to um, make a determination on that yet. Now, police believe the damage to this ATM machine was done around 5 a.m. this morning. But police say until they can get their hands on some surveillance video, either from the bank or that car dealership, they're hoping someone here in the community may have seen that truck driving around Foley early this morning and provide some helpful information. If you can do that, you're asked to call Foley Police. Reporting live in Foley, Hal Sherrick, Fox 10 News.